He's okay compared to everyone else, though. Grin's good. Grin's actually good. Snow's good. Nah, fuck you. <laughs> uh, look at the sign. What do we have? Uh, who? That don't look good. Not very appetizing. Frozen yeah. solid. Who'd want to eat this? No one. Bet that's what Beast was talking about. Don't say his name out loud. Hmm. That logo looks familiar. Bring him back. I've seen this before at Anti Greenleafs. Shit. I could ring or I could just. I kind of want to go in, but I kind of want to do it the right way. Let's do it the right way. Ring a ding ding, motherfucker. How you doing? Big B Wolf? Hello. What happened to you? I'm looking for a piece of the magic mirror. Um, wh what? The magic mirror's missing shard. Where is it? Bloody so Mary brought it here, didn't she? Let's do what? it the right way. I'm gonna kill Bloody you. Mary? What kind of magic mirror shard? <laughs> What kind of place do you think this is? Don't bullshit me. The front for the cookie not. man. not. What you're looking for, I... I think you'd be better off looking at, uh, the Lucky Pond. I was just there. Yeah, or someplace like in blood. that. You know where it is, right? It's around the corner and a few blocks down. I've been there. I didn't find what I was looking for. Had some words with Jersey, too. Words? Anyway, if, if I'd have known you already looked at the Lucky Pond, I... I I wouldn't have pointed you there. I, I just figured anything worth a damn in Fable Town goes through Jersey's hands at some point. You know that. Believe me, I don't want to waste your time, Sheriff. And I certainly don't mean to offend. I don't know how else to help. <laughs> yeah, well, Jersey wasn't very helpful. In fact, he was a total asshole. Oh, sorry. I've only been in that place a couple of times. I, I guess I don't know him too well. Listen, uh -huh, sure. Crane had the mirror. Mary had Crane. And she comes around here, right? If you're covering for her, I'm gonna have a problem with you. So you better think real hard about what you say next. Damn right. I... Sheriff... Did you hear that? What? Oh, you I'm real sorry. Fucker. Hold on. I, I just gotta go check on that. Don't go anywhere. I'll be right back. Butcher? I just have to go see. You fucker. Shit. Well, shit. I got it covered back here, Sheriff. I'll be right out. Uh, yeah, sure. Enough of this shit, Johan. Come on out. Just wait in the front. I'll be right out. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, safety purposes. Uh huh. Get the fuck out of the meat. Come on, damn it. For such an innocent guy, you're acting pretty damn strange, Johan. I don't know what to tell you. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. They're gonna kill me. Oh, God, she is gonna fucking kill me. He's gonna get me killed. Things I do. Huh? How you doing? How you doing? Please, don't. Bigby, what happened to Sheriff? Please, don't kill me, Sheriff. 
I don't want to die. Please, please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Listen, just calm the fuck down, okay? I just want some answers. Okay. I'm dead. Either way, they said to me, Johan, you could keep your life and lose your shop, or lose both. What would you do? It, it was a simple choice to make in the moment. Easy, even when they got down the hook in the deep freeze. They? Do you mean Mary? Bloody Mary? This isn't my shop anymore. That crew took it from me a long time ago. Crew? Fuck. The Crooked Man's people. Jersey Devil, D and Dumb, and that mental case, Bloody Mary. Y you want to talk about the real butcher? <laughs> it's her, not me. This is her place. I'm telling you, they muscled in on me. Took over my storage and delivery a long time ago. All cause of that heat wave. That summer was even hotter than this one. Oh, I'd let Mary and those porkers stay cool in the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Shows what I get for being nice. I'm just a victim in this. I don't know what they do back there. I swear. A and I don't want to know. I'm not allowed to know. Well, we're about to see what's back there. And then we'll see if I believe you. I knew this would happen. Didn't know when. But there... Ah, open up! Let's break the damn lock. Cooking meth? What the fuck? Run. You motherfucker. That's what that thing was for in the front. Thought it was sounding an alarm for somebody to come and help him. Nope. I'm gonna fucking run. What is this place? I told you, Big P. I don't know. They muscled me out. I swear, I don't know anything more. I haven't been back here when it was like this. Warning lights. This business, it's all I've ever had. I guess that's why I stuck around when they took it. Damn it, you can't act like you're forced into this and then turn around and help them. They'd still be here if you hadn't flipped that switch out there. I had to! Huh. You come in here making trouble for me? But you only give a shit now because the crooked man stepped on your toes or something. Where were you when they took this place from me? It hasn't management. been easy for me. You, you think I want to live with this at my back? I needed help. I needed your help. Well, I'm here now. I'm gonna sort this all out. Uh... So this is what Beast was delivering. Glamours. Other kinds of magic. Could be dangerous stuff. Oh, shit. Chains? Who's getting chained up here? You can't think I'm the only one the crooked man has under his yoke. Is this what those loans get you? Fucking that sick. crooked piece of shit. Ribbons, chains, it's... it's all the fucking same. Oh, we're... fucking cr crooked man's... Fucking crooked face up. It's gonna make what it fucking straight. There? I'm just a butcher. You wanna talk T-bones? <laughs> that I can do. This stuff is out of my league. There are a lot of nasty spells you can make with the right equipment. Uh, These are raw materials for making magic. Anti-Greenleaf and any other rogue witches out there probably get their supplies here. Probably. Erased everything. Too bad they had time to erase it all. This could have been useful. Wait, it slides. Ah, shit.
I should have gone here first. I don't know. That symbol. It's on all the packages. What is it? That's the crooked man's uh, brand. It's on everything that goes in and out of here. So you do know something, huh? Is that a, a wheel or what? I guess they never use that thing on wolves, huh? What's that supposed to mean? It's from back in the homelands. A torture device. It came over here with the rest of our stories. Not that Mondays need any help coming up with that kind of thing. It makes people crooked. By breaking their bones and... Do I really need to explain this? What the hell is that? What? Ooh. Whose is that? Is that... Cranes? I know this isn't your coat. What's it doing here? It's a coat. What's the big deal about some dirty... Looks like cranes. It's seen yep. some abuse. I'm sure he handled it just fine. Got what he deserved. No time for traveler's checks, huh? Oh, fuck that. He Thank won't you. be needing this anymore. Oh, you... It's technically not his. You're not getting it. That sick piece of... Fuck it. Oh, my gosh. The shard. It's the shard. Finally. How do you keep that in your pocket hey, and then not hold cut on. you? Well, I'm real happy you found what you're looking for, Bigby. But what about me? What huh? about you? What the hell am I supposed to do now? I'm going to have to spend the rest of my short life looking over my shoulder for Bloody Mary. You won't have to worry, Johan. I'm going to take him down. Thank you. Thank you, Sheriff. It's my job. It's what I'm here for. I'm taking him down. You can get your damn shop back. You can get that room back there to be yours again. It's your place. I don't care who killed the prostitutes. If Crane was helping himself to the community coffers, it means his hand was in my pocket, and you just let him go! I don't know what you heard, but it didn't happen like that. Are you denying the facts? Uh, she's denying me the chance to get a word in. Now, Miss White, I... Sheriff Bigby has returned. Ah, oh, there's the old wrecking bowl himself. Bigby, where have you been? I'm not finished here, Miss White. You will have to wait. <sighs> just one moment, please. Hello. Look what I found. Seems your dog wants a biscuit. I'm not in the mood. And you've got a lot to answer for. Oh, really? Buffkin, get this piece in the mirror right away. With pleasure, Miss White. <sighs> Finally, things are swinging back in the right direction. Good work, Bigby. You've been gone all day. What did you uncover? I thought you were going to report back to... I mean, it's fine. So what else did you find out? I had to get real persuasive with the Jersey Devil down at the Lucky Pawn, but he told me that the Crooked Man's door, to wherever it is he hangs his hat, it moves. It's some kind of magic door. Do you think the mirror will be able to find the door, once it's fixed? That's how Crane did it, and that's how we're gonna do it. Excellent work. Really. Sheriff, I could use your assistance. Would you join me at the mirror? Just one piece. Don't go far, Sheriff. I'd like I'm to have a few words over of here. my own with you. Unbelievable. Pompous ass. Why the hell did you burn Crane's stuff, huh? Don't bullshit me. Buffkin was there. I know it was you. Given Ichabod's obsession with Miss White, I thought it best to make sure that nothing uh, untoward saw the light of day. Oh, fuck off. I know you were burning evidence. Then tell me, what evidence did I burn? I have more important things to deal with right now. You can be sure that we're gonna have a long fucking talk about this when I'm done. I do so enjoy our talks. I'll wait with bated breath. Eat a dick. 
I don't understand. This piece just doesn't want to join the rest. Do you have any idea why? Got me. Well, where did you find it? What has it gone through since being separated from the rest? Shattering is a very traumatic experience, you know. So this process can be a little touchy. It helps that I have a good working relationship with the mirror. And I don't mind speaking in rhyme. Crane was carrying it. For part of the night, at least. I found it in his coat. It's uh, pretty amazing it's still intact after the fight, the kidnapping, and then riding around with Bloody Mary for uh, however... Yes, Miss White was asking about her. That explains it. You know who and the mirror have a very unhappy history with each other. How would you like it if she tried to use you as a doorway? I think I already know the feeling. Well, I think I know how to proceed now. It will just take a little extra coaxing, that's all. Thank you for your help. It could be a while, Sheriff. I'll find you when it's ready. Besides which, he might not want to come out with you watching. Oh, he doesn't like being spied on. If you ask me, you're everything that's wrong with Fabletown. Is it fixed? Did you ask about the Crooked Man? Buffkin's still working on it. He said it might be a while. If you're so self-reliant, what do you want from the business office so bad? What I want is my business. Crane is everything wrong. I can't take those two right now. We're trying to catch a murderer, and they're... They're over there bickering about bureaucracy. We're at war. Don't they realize that? Do you need some help over there? Yeah, thanks. Go talk to Toad. But just so you know, we can't pay him. He really needs to go to the farm, you know. So, just break the news and be done with it, I did try to pay him, though, but he didn't take it, so... Toad, come here. I thought I made myself very clear. I see how it is. Passed off to an underling, eh? Why am I not surprised? Well, you did cause what damage brings me in here, so maybe it's for the best. Just need a little bit of dosh to cover it. I tried talking to her about it, but it's like chatting up a brick wall You asked for her for cash? No, I'm sure you've got your own agenda, Sheriff. But I've taken a real wallet because of you. Hey, I tried to give you money back at the Lucky Pond, but you wouldn't take it. I was just being polite. Ever heard of it? That wouldn't have covered the cab ride home, let alone a glamour. Please, I'm not looking for any more than to cover the big ticket damages. Not a cent more. I'm not looking for a handout. Just what's right. I need it, Big B. Look, I don't write the checks around here, but I know I had a hand in it, so I'll try to get Snow to take care of you. Please do. It's the only way I'll be able to get me glamours. Yeah, all right. But uh, this isn't exactly a new problem with you, Toad. You know that if you're out of glamour, I gotta send you to the farm. Well, how about your friend the pig, hmm? Is he going to the farm too? Yeah, you thought we didn't know about him, huh? A worst kept secret in Fable Town. For a friend, the rules will bend. That's a slippery slope, that is. I haven't decided on him yet, but every situation's different, Toad. Well, might I suggest a path of compassion for the pig? And me and me boy, too. If you give me one more chance and hear me out, I'll see a way for me and me boy to stay. I'm not going to ask for any more than I need. I just want to stay. So what do you say? You just give me enough to cover me glamours and we'll call the rest a wash. You need, to, you need the glamours. You need to get a job Sarah, so that you can pay for more glamours. If you don't get a job, you can pay for more. This is a waste of my money to give to you. Oppressive. I've done nothing wrong but look different. You know it's not right, burdening the weakest of us like this. Look, you were unglamored three days ago, and you're still unglamored now. I can't ignore that. But you go to the farm, things cool down here a bit. Maybe you can come back at some point. Best I can do. What? I didn't. What a crook of shite. I didn't choose to send him. Fables for the fables, my ass. I thought that was more of like, I'll give you the money or oh, whatever the fuck. For now, then if you can Blue work, beer. get you some money. You wanna talk? Now's your chance. Fucking I hell. just made my donation funding this office. So direct your questions to Miss White. I didn't... Damn it. Well, at least he's not trying to get rid of me. He's not? For now. Did you take care of Toad? I mean, I saw the way he left. I know it may not seem that important right now, 
But glamours are the law for a very good reason. You know that as well as anyone. Well, did you or didn't you? Oh, what? <sighs> that go it. Fine, we'll deal with it later. I know I should be asking how it got like this, but <laughs> I just smart. keep wondering why it happened Faith. to Faith and Lily. You've seen his world. Do you have any idea why he'd want them dead? I don't know if the crooked man killed them with his own hand or if it was one of his goons, but someone did. What would make a person do that? Control? If there's one thing I've figured out, it's that the crooked man is all about control. It's what he does with the loans at the pawn shop, the magic he peddles, chains, ribbons. Maybe Faith and Lily weren't doing what they were told. Or maybe they just tried to leave. Sheriff, Miss White, I believe the mirror is repaired. Whoa. I have to say, I have been better. But thanks for putting me back together. And I'm sorry, kicks I just, I have to know. Mirror, mirror, we're glad you weren't slain. Now please show us that sick creep crane. That sick fuck crane. <laughs> Sneeze again. Sorry. He's probably still waking up a little. Yeah, I want to see where he's ended up to. Yeah. It's not important, but I guess... You will get on that plane to Paris, and you will wait for the day the Crooked Man needs you. Until then, not a peep. Wait, Otherwise, Paris. I get to deal with you my way. So please, please disobey. Wait a minute. Someone's watching. just happened we pointed you in the wrong direction and looked at bloody mary's reflection oh her that explains the sting i'd rather not have to feel the pain she brings i'm in more pain than you so, buddy <laughs> let's not do that i again, got shot okay I'd she like didn't like to one drag him fucking. down later you're right we need to focus on the immediate threat and that's the crooked man Cheetos did all the work but Baby. anyway we don't Most have a lot of time. Are you having trouble with the rhyme, Sheriff? Perhaps I can be of assistance? Ah, oh, fuck it. <clears throat> mirror, mirror, keep us sane. Show the door to Crooked Man's domain. I can always count on you, Buffkin. Motherfucker. You gonna kiss him now? You gonna I kiss the monkey? I don't recognize the door, but that's the Crooked Man symbol on it. Hold on. door. It moves. what I tell you? Wait a minute. I know that door. That's Central Park. I don't know when it's gonna move again, but I'm gonna get there before it does. Bigby, wait. When you get the Crooked Man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. This can't be like it was with Tweedledum. I don't care if it gets out of hand. You don't let it come to that. If it I know gets that out of hand... And you have your reasons to handle this a certain way. I can't make that promise. This could turn sour, just depending on how the wind blows. I have to be able to handle it how I see fit. If people are going to have faith in the Fable Town government again, we need to be fair. Show them that we're doing things I'm the gonna right do it the right way. way but I have I'm enough to worry about here. Corner, while I and I have to kill him. him. I'm so I'm going to trust him. you to handle this properly. That is, but if, if I have you a choice. Of course bring I'm him right. in or kill him? I got no bring other him choice. in! Why would I kill him? It's if I'm backed into a corner. Done! It depends on where the wind blows. The Gothic Brent. I'm running. Hello, Dora. I'm gonna kick you the fuck in. I think that was a pull, not a push door. Also, so why am I the fuck back here? I'm like this far back. Oh shit, sign. Came in through like Harry Potter. It's a cripple. Tim. What 
the hell are you doing here? Good evening, Sheriff. I'm here to take you to the boss. Thanks, by the way, for leaving off Tiny. Tiny uh, Tim. I have to admit, when they asked me to watch the door, I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. But I get it. You're not here on a social call. What is this place? Or where is it? I know I'm not in Central Park anymore. I'm not sure. I've only ever come in through one of the portals. I don't think you can get in from the actual street. But you can't blame him for wanting to make it hard to find. I'm supposed to bring you right on in, so if you'll come this way. Look, this is the one thing I have to do. Fine, lead on. All right, then. Thanks for understanding. This is all I'm here to do, and I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> I know I'm probably the last person you'd expect to be a guard, or an escort for that matter. You shouldn't be here, Tim. This place is dangerous, especially for someone like you. It's not like that. Whatever you may think of him, he doesn't treat me like some broken little kid. I think he gets what it's like. He gave me a job, and I'm lucky to have it. This is the only option I've got. Just keep that in mind, maybe? Because if you and the boss go up against each other, the rest of Fable Town is going to get caught in the middle. And if you're here, it can't be good. I can find the door myself. You should just get the hell out of here. Things are gonna get ugly in a minute. Leave. I told you, I have to do this. Hey, you've been warned. Stick around, and you're a part of this just like anyone else. Well... A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. We need you, but we need him too. What we don't need is a war. Hey, Sheriff, hold up! I gotta go in with you. Uh. Thanks. <laughs> Am I some kind of a fucking joke to you? Oh. What did I tell you, eh? Stop laughing at me. Oh, yeah? Mate, tell me who the I fuck is back you. there. I hear Jersey and I, Georgia. I don't exactly know. I, I you just mind the door. The boss around. is there. I like cream before him. That much. I'm sure he will prove himself quite handy to have in my pocket. Either he's smart enough to see this is for the best, or dim enough to do as he's told. I say he'd be more useful killed. Can I make you go? And made into a rug for me to wipe his shoes on. That bloody monster killed my poor. Yeah. Bloody hell! This fucking guy! Hello! What's up, bitches? Oh, you settled the fuck down. I crushed your head in. And I'm half crippled. I was wondering when you'd turn up. Hello. I'm sorry, sir. He, he wouldn't let it's me. It's all right, Tim. I shouldn't have expected the sheriff to give you respect enough to do your job. But you did fine. You can go now. You see, everyone in Fable Town has a role to fill. You just have to pay attention to what they need to help them find it. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. <laughs> I'm gonna smoke. I've heard stories about you. In the old days, how you picked off those men one by one. Oh, how they screamed. The wolf is coming. And they would wait. Hiding anywhere they could squeeze their pathetic, shivering corpses. Some would just drop to their knees where they stood, close their eyes, and wait for death. And you'd give it to them. 
<laughs> I wish I could have seen it. <sighs> oh well.